He's going to have to run him wide. He does. Oh, boy. Contact. Almendinger trying to force the issue to the inside. Nothing there. He's up against the bumper of Tyler Reddick. Reddick side by side. Chastain takes the lead back. That Power a move. Strong move. He had to get into him a little bit. He leaned on him, but it, man, if he didn't, he was going to be swallowed up. He'd have been fourth right there. Aggressive move, but that's what it takes to win this race. Absolutely. He didn't do anything to take anybody out. Nobody spun out in the transaction. Let it go. And he's pulling away. Because they're side by side for second. Almendinger inside has the preferred line here. And he has second. Over Reddick and Bowman. With Christopher Bell in fifth. Chastain needs to utilize his strong suit. Where was it in this third zone? Get through the stadium section good. Make sure, make sure you've got enough distance between you and AJ that he can't dive bomb you into 11. We all know that's where the setup is. Bowman to the inside is going to grab third spot. And Chastain now just has to drive time trial laps. He honestly Careful. just needs to not make mistakes that's right, right now. That's exactly just what you're doing. Calm down. Run your lap. Run your smooth lap. Make AJ have to do all the work. AJ's the one that's going to have to pressure himself to catch him if he just runs a solid lap at front. Mine isn't. My heart rate's <laughs> through the roof. His might be 149. I'm anxious and excited for him. And I think, again, just like I said, utilize your strong suits. He did a great job through the stadium section, gaining some ground. If I'm his spotter, I'm telling him everything's in front of him. Don't look at that mirror. Don't worry about anything behind. Just run your lap right now. Chase Briscoe has a flat tire. One lap to go. The leader has seen the white flag. So the next flag, the race will be over. AJ Allmendinger, three quarters of a second back. Hey guys, unless the 48 gets close, just leave him alone here. That's Allmendinger's radio. And yeah, stay through the really far with Chastain. Yep. Getting through those S's really good. Through the S's, Allmendinger loses a tenth of a second to the leader. Ross has done a great job of getting off the corner, getting back to the gas, not slipping the tire. That has been his strong suit. Hey, just... Kyle Busch has spun but continues. And he was running fifth. I was just fixing to say the rebound of Joe Gibbs. Here it comes. The last ditch effort dive bomb. Quite a ways back. 160 miles an hour. Down this back straightaway to turn 12 and then down to 45 miles an hour Look right here. Much ground, AJ Almonier gains right there. But Chastain didn't miss the apex. He's on him. Almoninger's there. Open the door up. He won't open this one up though, nope. right here. No. Nope. Oh, he's gonna use AJ's gonna open it for him. Yeah. Moved him! Moved him. AJ moved him. He's gonna get Chastain moved back. Chastain comes back. Chastain, will he answer? And Bowman wants to steal it. Oh, that he'll get the chance. Bowman's under him. Oh my God. <laughs> Chastain's Bowman gonna have to move them both. He's gonna have to move them both. Oh, he is. Oh. And around Bell goes all the both. off the bumper of Chastain. And Ross Chastain beats and bangs his way to turn 20 and off One the race. corner to the checkered flag. Hey, I don't mind that. He got moved and moved him back. Absolutely. Great job, boy. A little damage to the right front. Noah Gregson in the nine. Oh, big contact. That's going to hurt that inside line. The 54 is way back there, so now they're organized on the outside. Noah is all by himself. Brandon Brown trying to stay behind the 21. Noah's trying hard to side draft and slow that 21 down. He's doing a pretty good job there. Helps got to get there quick, though. Big run coming from the top. Gibbs got there. Now the 14 behind the 54. 
Haley behind the 54. That's a big deal. Now the Haley in the middle. Oh, contact ran around Rick. into the wall. The 14 Here's goes around as well. Ty Gibbs also. The big one happening Car again. The out. caution Car comes out. out. The green is out. NASCAR overtime for the title. There goes Zane. He got there first. Zane Smith on the inside. Rhodes getting squeezed in the middle and Chandler Smith on the outside. Zane Smith's got the lead. Chandler trying to cross over. Chandler's going to get there, Vince. Side by side, Chandler Smith in that 18 truck now to the bottom. He's going to slide up and this could open the door for Rhodes. Rhodes coming in. The white flag is out. The final lap. Throw a blanket over the three for the championship. Zane Smith has got it, but Chandler Smith on the inside taking a look. That's Rhodes on the outside. Down the back stretch. He's Zane Smith. The runner up each of the last two years. Can Rhodes get to the bumper and move him? Zane Smith is winning it, and he has done it. The championship goes to Zane Smith. NASCAR overtime seems quite fitting on the return to IRP. Who's going to win it? Oh, a great start by John under that time. Zane surges back side by side. Nemechek gets into the wall. Zane didn't give him a whole lot of room. Here comes Enfinger down the backstretch, battling with Ankrum for second. Enfinger gets the spot. Boy, look at that thing. Look at those new tires on the bottom. Enfinger on the inside now, challenging Zane Smith. The white flag is out. Grant Enfinger on the final lap. Closes the door on Zane Smith, and now Rhodes comes up to challenge Zane. Grant Infinger entered the playoffs ninth out of 10 drivers. A subpar season, but he has turned it around in one start of the playoffs. Grant Infinger wins at IRP. It'll be nine to go in stage two. Out of block and on the bottom. Reddick tried oh. to get underneath Suarez and Blaney around again. And he this gets nailed by the 11. And it's the big one in turn two. The restart's so important. Byron on the inside. Gibbs on the outside. Back up through the gears to go. A great restart for Gibbs. We'll see if he can make it work. To the inside, the 17 goes up the racetrack. He goes, and the 54 has to go very high now. Almost all the top 10 is off the course. They're three wide for third as everybody's jostling for real estate. Ty Gibbs is slipping in the corner. Byron goes wide to accommodate. They lean on each other in turn four. Side by side for the lead. Larson thinks for a moment three wide at the backstretch. Larson's going to push the 17 of Byron down into the breaking zone. Here comes Ty Gibbs side by side. There's going to be contact. Bus cars go spinning. Sideways. Bus cars are spinning out of the lead. Larson goes through AJ. Sammy Smith in the third. No push for that one car right now. Yeah, I'd like to see them be a little bit closer together than they were. Good organization on the outside line. Oh, contact. The seven and the 19. Trent in the middle. Three wide. Here comes Chase Elliott. Chase through the middle. Truex now to the outside. Going backwards. Now, Corey LaJoy trying to block both lines. To the high side. Here comes Chase Elliott. LaJoy up to block him. Coming to two to go here. Chase is going to get a run on this seven car at the end of the front straightaway. We know he's went to the inside. This side to the outside. Coming outside. 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 car to the lead. Now he's got to decide what lane he's going to go. Is it the bottom or the top? Big push from the one car on the seven here. Push is coming from both sides. Elliott goes down to block. Corey's clear. He's clear of the 43. One lap to go. Presented by Credit One Bank. LaJoy loose behind the nine. Now he goes to the high side. All the way up into the wall goes LaJoy. He's going to spin around. On, He'll dude, collect the field. On, Caution will come out. And it looks as though the nine of Chase Elliott is going to be scored the winner. Oh, 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 oh and there goes 
the nine, turned on the restart. That and a big crash going into turn one. That was not ideal. I, uh, I didn't see that coming. <laughs> push me, brother, push me. Pert doesn't get the start that, no, he didn't. He needed. Joey did. And he's going to dive Joey. in front. Slide job, moving up in front of him. Here comes the crossover. Kyle, will he get into him? Inside, two back, both lanes behind, 45. He's going to see another slide job right here. Kyle Busch drives it way off into the corner. Logano needs it. Oh, he slid way up the track. Crossover coming. And here comes Blaney. And he's got a pusher right behind him. Uh, oh, and sideways is Bush. Yeah. Excuse me, Kyle's sideways loose. One lap to go. The race is official. Logano well out front of Kyle Busch. The race is for third. Kurt Busch and Blaney. Behind them, Ross Chastain three wide. Nobody's surprised. How about that restart? You knew it was going to be wild. Joey Logano. Those two were going for it. Joey did exactly what he needed to do. Off turn four, Joey Logano. Hey, yeah. Nice the, job, dude. The Penske hey. Ford oh, Mustang, yeah, a winner oh, in St. Louis. Louis. Big jump by oh. Kyle. Kyle gets the good jump. Bowman still there in second. He just needs to clear Friesen in a hurry so he can continue the pursuit. Oh, he does he have a action. Yeah, Friesen and Bowman, a little bit of contact there, kept free, kept Bowman back, and Friesen in the second spot. Bowman third. It's the best thing that could have happened for Kyle Busch, I think, as fast as that seven looked on the last restart. Especially on the way down to 11 there. Bowman was able to really make a move there. We've seen him close back up on the 52. 52 has been brave on the brakes. I don't know if he's got the truck that the seven's got. Here comes 34. 38, excuse me, from row five, three. St. Smith has moved up. Yeah, yeah. Bowman just racing with urgency to get around. Stewart Friesen oh, to have a shot. Oh, oh, it's all three of them together. And St. Smith, Smith on the double stage winner is going to go to P1. Kyle slips back to fifth. Wow, Zane Smith out front, and now Bowman getting around Friesen. Does Bowman have enough speed to catch Zane? They, they've been trying to wreck on the middle of the back straightaway there for a few seconds and finally accomplished that. Oh, this puts Kyle behind the eight ball here. Here comes Kligerman. Kligerman now charging to challenge Alex Bowman for second. Friesen way off line, getting wedges way back in, yes. Man, they're still wrecking back in the field. Look at Crafton. <laughs> Crafton's in the dirt <laughs> coming through 14. He went off the street. You don't think those positions matter? Look at the contact. Fighting for every spot on the final lap. I'm so proud of my row three, Vince. That's exactly, you called it. They went from <laughs> row three to row one. Five and six went one, two. Zane Smith right. taking it home. What a drive. Zane Smith wins at Circuit of the Americas. Scott, and will it be two more laps? That question to be answered as well. We are once again in overtime. Oh, Presented contact. by Credit One Bank. Timmy Hill back in the back of the nine car. You saw the contact. AJ's going to push the 21 clear. Here comes the nine. Austin Hill Austin's worked gonna in front. Yeah, Austin's going to continue to try to defend that. You mentioned you didn't think it would get to be three wide. Pretty tight pack trying to stay at least two wide. A little bit of help here coming for A.J. Allmendinger, and he's going to give it right to Noah Gregson oh, into the wall. He'll go. Oh, oh man. Big okay. hit for Gregson, lock it down, lock and the it down. caution comes out again. What happens in row two? Looks like the bottom is organized very well here. De Benedetto giving a good push to Eckes. Holmes now to the back bumper of the 99 of Rhodes. And that's gonna have momentum. He didn't get to him at first, but now that he's there, look at him come. Brett Holmes right now doing a great job pushing 
Ben Rhodes, is he going to push him out in front? He is. They're both clear. Rhodes and Holmes, 1 2 now in front of Eckes. That momentum was impressive, but here they come on the outside. Now Eckes to the outside to join Rhodes. And, and the bottom line is moving with a push from De Benedetto. It's Holmes to the lead. A couple Chevrolets down on the bottom. De Benedetto and Holmes. The Toyotas are side drafting, trying to break that up. Coming Making to the white, ground. White flag is out. One to go. Next one ends it. Next flag ends it. Vince, as you mentioned. It's Holmes, the Alabama native, trying to win for the very first time in his Camping World Truck Series career. The former ARCA champ, he is out front. He might be too, off, too far out in front now, Vince. Here comes Rhodes with a push from Eckes' teammate on the outside. And Rhodes cuts in front of Holmes. Look at Corey Heim now pushing on the outside. Eckes on the outside, Rhodes on the inside, teammates at Thorsport. Here they come into the tri-oval. You gotta stay bottom lane, bottom lane. Rhodes in the lead. Players. Wreck to the outside. Rhodes still there, trying to hold off. And the yellow and the checkers fly. And is it Brent Holmes? It's official, the 25 of Matt DiBenedetto, the winner at Talladega. His first career win. Green flag. Oh, big shot. That all started with Harrison Burton giving Bubba Wallace a big shot down on the corner, knocked Kurt Busch out of the way. And Sindrick dives it in there again, and he's going to come out maybe with third, maybe with fourth. How did that happen? Didn't see it coming for sure. Elba, gloves are off, boys. All right, third, side by side. The rookie, Austin Sindrick, the former champion, Kurt Busch, the two in the 45. One of them may make the show. The other goes home. And Harrison Burton to the inside for the lead. Austin Sindrick. Burton got into oh. Wallace, and the rookie takes the lead. The fight is on for second and third. Here comes Sindrick on the inside. Oh. Wham! Three and Kurt Busch three. piles into the outside wall. Little contact already right there with the nine and the eight. The better restart. Chase Elliott almost a clear of the eight car. Eight's going to try to outbreak him down here in the breaking zone. All right, just on your left, one on your right now. Middle, 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 middle. A lot middle, of contact. Middle, around middle, goes middle, two middle. cars, three cars now around. The nine car. Chase Elliott is spun out. 24 of William Byron also has been around. And now, Eric Jones oh. to the 43 goes around. True X. Dillon. Austin Dillon in the three, Truex. stops in the gravel. Truex with a flat left front tire. Can he get out of that gravel? If Dillon doesn't get it fired back up and going. So far, he's still sitting there, guys. Hasn't moved yet. That's going to be another caution. He's, he's trying stuck. to back up, he's and he stuck. can't. He's stuck. He's gonna, stuck. This is going to have to be a yellow. NASCAR's going to give him as much time as possible. But at some point, the cars are going to go speed through there. There you go. There's, There's the, the yellow. Caution. Green is out again at Martinsville. 19, right on there. him. He's going to pull, put it in. Brandon there. Jones Whoa. is there. Contact. Ty Gibbs up the track. Brandon Jones side by side for the lead. Underneath you. Get drive off. Clear level. Get in cover it. Don't overdrive her in. Gibbs able to clear him. 19's going to have a run yeah. off. 54 four. slipped up pretty big. Yep. He's White there. Flag. 19's there. Half a mile to go. Here's Jones again. 54 is still slipping out. Doing it clean right now. Gibbs up the track. No contact this time. Keep him out there. He's going to have to run him up. Use it. Jones down low. He's he's Gibbs up clear. high. Here Brandon comes Brandon Jones. Jones. First win of the year. Unbelievable. 25 cars on the lead lap. It'll be 33 to go. Drag race for both sides, both lines with help behind them. Will the 19 stay with the 24 does? Three wide. Oh, wow. That ain't oh, work out. Oh, Truex. Hold on to it, hold on to it. Here Truex, Jake Hugger. Oh, push. Well, you said it wasn't going to be the last one. You were right, Bill. Ah, uh, that didn't work out. A lot yeah, of big cars, heavy hitters in this wreck. Here we go.
Another good push by Custer on the bottom. Same result. Puts that one car back out front. 20 cars on the lead lap, including Christopher Bell, who just got the free pass. Oh, oh Suarez! Briscoe got him into Briscoe. the back of Suarez. And he gets pounded. Dang it. Oh, yeah. up push and upside down. I think he hooked a drain. has sparks underneath the car. He'll come to pit road. That leaves the 21 of Austin Hill, the lone man on old tires, Rick. And he's up in front. We'll see how well he does on those older tires. Noah Gregson to his inside as they enter one. Gregson takes the lead back. Brandon Jones to the inside. And Gregson way to the inside now. Trying to make sure no one got any kind of draft off of him. You see Brandon Jones right there. He was hoping that that two car of Creed would run that second lane and get him some clean air on the bottom. Now he's still beside, still beside him. Can he make that pass? Yes, he did. This is where staying out is going to really hurt the 21. He needs to get about nine more laps to be inside his fuel window. And now he's lost that clean air. Oh, oh. big wreck. Huge contact. 48 is involved. That's Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Now up and over goes the 27. So Jeff Burton sliding on top. Somebody's going to get you. Well, it looked like Ty waited a long time in that restart zone. As you see, that's exactly what I would do. I would pull down to the bottom as quick as I can. And Noah decided to go to the outside. Wow, he's almost caught him off guard, but can he get it turned? He, he does. Gets into the to the left rear of the 54 just a little bit. Now Mozak went through the chicane, right? He he did not make the corner, but I did not notice him stopping. We'll continue to follow what the 18 does as the battle for the lead is on. Here comes Noah Gregson forcing Gibbs wide. The nine is out front. Gibbs rallying back with Creed in the mix. And there's contact. Gibbs into Gregson, who's in the grass. All of this happening with seven to go in stage two. Well, this will get interesting if Noah Gregson can ever get back up there because it looked like Ty was a little bit mad that Noah got into him. Didn't push him all the way off the racetrack, but then it, it looked like Ty did retaliate and go ahead and spin out the I nine think car. This damage we see on the left rear might tell more of a story here, JV, other than being run off to the left side of the track. When they were coming out of turn two, I think there was some pretty heavy contact there to get Noah to the, the position that he was in going into turn four. And we're back under green here in stage one in Michigan. A lot of movement back there in the back, two and three wide. Pretty even. Oh, look at that. Guys getting checked up. Big, big contact back there. JJ Ailey's around the 10, the two hard into the wall. Oh, good. Kyle Bush involved. Big damage on the 18 as well. It Great launch by the 18 on the outside. Sammy Smith. The contact from behind. There was a little bumper, another. Hit to the inside for the 19. Now the 19 is getting hit on both sides. Three wide to Gibbs, boys. They're sliding. Sammy Smith slides out of the way. Here comes the nine of Noah Gregson. The caution comes out before they get to the line. Ty Gibbs, Noah Gregson making up row one. Brandon Jones, Sheldon Creed make up row two. Good restart by the 19. And that outside line as well. Big push by the 19. And he gets to the inside again. Three wide as they come out of two. Now, three wide isn't going to work through three and four. Sheldon Creed shoving the 19. He's sideways, but he lurches out front. The white flag one more time around. Jones Whoa. gets tagged by the 54. Whoa. Ty Gibbs out front. Jones around. Caution comes out. Ty Gibbs sees the checkered yellow flags. Hamlin, Dillon in row three. Kyle Busch, Cole Custer, Harvick, and Ty Dillon. Here we go. Pretty even drag race. Still in line. 
on here. All clear. All clear. Clear up. Three makes it three wide. Here. Dylan. Still in run. trouble in the back. Comes a big run by that three on four tires. Look He's out. There. Here it is. He's there on Kyle Larson. Austin to the bobbles just a little oh, bit. Oh, now he's on the outside. Chastain's got him four wide. Oh, oh they're wrecking. Unbelievable. Three laps to go. Freshest tires up front. Christopher Bell, can he get up there and win his way into the next round? Three flags back in the air. A lot of contact into turn one. The They're wrecking. They're wrecking. The 34's in the wall as well. 48s. Will they be able to keep going? Harrison Burton in the 21. He's turned around as well. They keep banging on the side. It's the 16 of Almendinger in front now. He's sideways. Harvick's in his side. AJ off of the track. Harvick in the lead. Kevin Harvick takes the lead away. Now running second, the nine of Chase Elliott. Oh, and around goes, goes the, the nine. nine. Elliott sliding through the grass. All right, forward. Back up front, the 20 of Christopher Bell is all the way up to fourth place, guys, and he's going for third. Kevin Harvick, slow, coming on to the big oval. And here comes Bell. Bell all the way up to second now as he's battling with Allmendinger. Christopher Bell pushing the 16 up over the humps. And now, congestion again. Problems in hey, that trilogy, chicane. The 14 is backwards, we're on board with him. The points are gonna completely move around as the field gets reset. And remember, if Bell wins, it's automatic advancement. It moves the entire cut line. He's in third with two to go. Two to go, Bell running third. Reddick is second. And everybody fighting for positions, including that two of Sindrick. Here comes Bell trying to close in on Reddick in second place. He's right on the back bumper of that eight car headed to turn five. And we've seen cars struggle through five and six today. There's Cindric. Everybody's trying to attack him on those over tires. Bell to the inside of the eight car. He takes second place. Bell going after the leader. Now, no cars between Christopher Bell on the freshest tires and Kevin Harvick leading the race. Cautions come out, there'll be a restart. Ty Dillon spun out here. Full course, full course. Carson Hosebar on the inside, Ryan Priest on the outside. NASCAR over time. Oh, something out of the Chastain, but there was what I was talking about. Need to check Mike go three wide. No, look at this. Eckes through the middle. With a big push on the back of Priest. Ah, Chastain's got to try Even to keep door. up. His truck's loose. It's not there. Here's the outside lane. Oh, they're Contact both between Hosevar and Priest. Now Chastain coming to the back bumper of his teammate. He did help him, didn't he? Three and four is going to be wild. They've always oh, got big damage. I told you. Oh, they're wild. They go. Hosevar is around, and the caution is out. The first race of the playoffs for the Xfinity Series, and Noah Gregson. Oh, John Hunter Nemechek. Stay oh. with him. With a great restart, oh. now Hill dives oh. to the inside. He's going to make it three wide as they go to one. Advantage on Hunter right here, I think. Oh, he's loose. Oh, no, he's in the wall. Oh. Hard into the wall. Wow. The oh, seven of all guy as well. Oh, Brandon oh, Jones is in it. Hemrick is involved. A lot oh, of playoff drives. Oh. nowhere to go, man. Yeah. Four wide. Trying to come out of turn two. Sam Mayer has damage. Green flag back in the air. Reddick has to go down the block. Better Lando. restart that time for Reddick, though. He's got a car length on second. Three wide, four wide for second. Here comes around. Austin Cedric. Ryan Blaney sideways in front of the field. Side by side up front though, Chastain, he's right there. They're going side by side through the kink. And around goes the one. He's able to get by the eight. Sideways though, that's going to allow Reddick to get a run on him. Lost momentum on corner exit. 
lot of dirt. Uh, and the 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 went off the track. If he did that access road to get back on track, now the aid of Tyler Reddick continues to fight him. Is this legal for the one to be up here racing right now? Like NASCAR's trying to figure that out themselves. Reddick trying to work hard to get back by him. He knows he has Austin Cindric behind him. But the one of Ross Chastain was off track. He used the access road after turn one after he missed it. Reddick fights back. He's going to try to take the outside line. Side by side right here. This is tough sledding to try to make this pass. It's a good position for Reddick. He's going to take the lead back. Reddick grabs the lead as he comes back out on the front stretch one more time around. Cinder's got to run on the one car. How hard will Chastain push in the braking zone here? He's in position. Reddick slows through one. He's clean. Lots Chastain and Cindric. We believe second and third. Chastain still unsure. Can he get through? 13. For the final time, he does. Oh, he almost misses the corner. Here comes the one of Ross Chastain one more time. Out of 14. Tyler Reddick looking for his second Cup Series win. It's going to come in Indianapolis. Back underway. Side by side and carnage in turn one. Six cars turned around. Can they get going again? Out front is Christopher Bell. He's past the four of Harvick. Blaney, one of those cars in turn one, finally pulling away. With Bell as the leader, that has Larson one point, just one point above the cut line. Cindric one back. Again, that's just a position on the racetrack. Cindric, if he gains a position, he'll be tied with Larson. And he is in a battle back here. You see it at the bottom of the screen, side by side with the 43 car of Jones down the back straightaway. And again, the tiebreakers, we see brakes locking up as oh. they go into Trilogy. Oh, the two's around. Hayden and around goes the two. Cindric now waiting to get back on track. Larson plus five now as they're running on the track. White flag in the air, one more time around. Christopher Bell, can he win his way into the next round of the playoff? Four cars spinning across the front straightaway here. Ty Dillon, the 23 cars, well, Ty Gibbs. Briscoe, Larson tied right now for the final spot. Briscoe trying to grab another position. With Briscoe, that. Briscoe's got to make this work. He's got to go find this spot. He's got new tires. The tiebreaker would go to Chase Briscoe, the best finish in this round, if they stay even. Christopher Bell now coming out onto the oval. Bell. What a day this would be for Christopher Bell. Briscoe underneath Eric Jones, but Austin Dillon underneath Briscoe. Those points are going to change again. The final time through the trilogy chicane for Christopher Bell. Right side, right side, all clear, all clear. Cole Custer throwing a block right there on everybody. Briscoe with a huge drive into the rear chicane. A two-point advantage for Briscoe and Christopher Bell. He has done it. He's won his way into the round of eight.